Welcome back, everyone. This is Spoog on Let's Play Brave Hensu Musashi Part 30. Yes, the real actual Part 30. I know. Last couple of uh, episodes I made, I accidentally said the wrong episode number. But, yay, I'm back on track now. So, alright. Here we go. Um, let's start this off. Last time we got the bell, so let's go ahead and take this out. Dookie dookie. Let load. Alright, pick it up. Pick it up. There we go. We'll just keep on throwing it. Goes faster this way. As you can tell, we're back in the uh, mine shaft. I believe it's this way, if I'm not mistaken. Yep. Ah, oh, too far. And of course he can't jump with this thing, but I will. We'll just walk out with it just in case so I don't lose it. But, no, in uh, this episode, basically, we're going to get back that bell, and then we're going to use the water scroll, actually, to achieve two more um, minkus, to get to find more two more minkus. I can't speak today. So, yep. Yes, I brought the bell back. Thank you. Here's a token of my appreciation. It's a statue of an angel. This is the key to our the boss, then, actually. So, yerp. I don't know if I'll have time to get to the boss, though. And I doubt it in this video. Of course you've seen this shape before. Yes, sacred key to the fire god. Fire god is the boss. Hint, hint, wink, wink. Yes, put the bell back. Somehow it just follows him. Okay, so now we got the water scroll. Let's go ahead and get these minkus. Okay, alright. First one is in Somnolent Forest. And the second one is on Twin Peak Mountains. Let me remember where things are for a second. Okay. Alright, we'll go this way first. And I just realized I didn't set a timer for myself yet again. Ha ha ha. Awesome me. I always forget. Okie dokie. I'm good now. Alright. Let's go in. Okay. Okay, so this is the, what, 8th Minku now? 8th or 9th? I... I seventh I really don't remember anymore but anyways it's in Twin Peak Mountains where is it in Twin Peak Mountains I can't talk right now but it's actually all the way at the very end and I'll show you once I get to the uh, double jump uh, stop lagging there we go okay keep on walking come on there we go Basically, we just walk the whole way to the end of the uh, Twin Peak Mountains. Well, as far as we can go. Come here. There we go. Alright. This is as far as we can go. Let's go ahead and charge that up. And use the water. And. Should have. Minku around here somewhere. Huh. That's weird. Strange. Ah, this is where the Minku is. All right, I was retarded. Okay. Now we just need to wait two hours. Because it starts at one o'clock. Or actually, oh, o'clock. Turn that on. There, and we'll go back. And bam. Come here, come here. Come here, come here. Come on. 
Come on. Ah. Stupid Minku. Jesus Christ. There we go. All right. Minku get. We got longevity berry. All right. Cool. All right, I'll just meet you guys back at the entrance then. To make things quicker. And we're back at the entrance. All right. Let's go back to the town so we can get to Somnolent Forest. I, I doubt that's how you say it or pronounce it, but whatevs. Go down. Okie dokie. Uh, camera movement hurts eyes and face. Okay. Is it this entrance or is that the far, far entrance? Alright, yeah, this entrance. Okay, now. The Minku should be here. Where there is Vata. Vata. Not that water. Not at least. That's important, mind you. See the water scroll? Yep. But I need to kill the guardian first. So, get that health. I just need to remember where. Herm. Absorption. Come on, come on. Boo, boo. Boo, 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 boo. This should be where it is. Turn on. Yep, this is where it's at. Okay. I'll see you guys in a bit when it's time for the Minku to come out. Alright, see you soon. Time for the Minku. Let's charge this up. Go over here real quick, sees. Go back up, and ha. Oh, that was quick. I don't think I've ever gotten a Minku that quick. Alright, cool. Okie dokie. Now I'll just go back to the... Oh, uh, I'm gonna sneeze. Maybe, maybe not. Possibly. No, I'm good. Alright. <laughs> Sorry. I'm good. Alright. So we just need to go back to... Z oh, are you kidding me? Uh, don't go to sleep. Don't go to sleep. Crap. There we go. Alright. We'll go back down into the cavern. Of course. Check it out. Okay. Alright, so we're back down here. Basically, all we have to do left here is enter that one entrance and kill the boss. But, as you can guys see, I have um, my fusion only at level 9 and everything else is below the maximum. So I'm actually going to grind for a little bit. But I'll be, I'm going to cut all that out. So, I'll see you guys in a bit when my, my levels are higher up all right so see you soon hey guys so i grinded up to the maximum level except for my mine but um i realized you know like four or five days passed since i was grinding i did it for like maybe half an hour to 40 minutes something like that so that means i can get the uh gloves now so i'm gonna go ahead and get the gloves from the maid and then i'll just cut us back to the uh entrance then so here's the, uh, oh wait, that's the wrong person. I'm retarded. It's the, uh, the weaver. Ma God damn it, I don't want to talk to you again. Ugh. Oh, Stupid maid. And your broom of nothing. Alright. Uh, weaver. 
Yeah, there she is. Hells yeah, you better give them over. Give him my gloves! Critical hit. Alright. Now, a lot of people will argue with me the fact of, oh, I should have gotten the, the quilt. The quilt was so amazing. It gets rid of tiredness and recovers your BP and all that. I mean, that's, that's cool and everything, but I mean, it's more of a, you know, beginner's type thing. Like, if you haven't played the game before, you know... You don't know your way around some things. That's then you go ahead and do that. But I was like, you know what? No, I've actually never really tried the gloves before, and I wanted to try it out for myself. You know, to see how good the critical hit was. So I decided, yeah, let's go with that. So that was my whole reasoning. Just to let you guys know. But yeah, all right. I'll cut us back into the entrance of the uh, cave then. All right. See you soon. Alright, and we're back. Okay, so as I, as you can see before, looking at my stats, I got 16 uh, of everything except for mind. Um, when they're flashing, that means they can't go any further. I decided, you know what, with the boss, it's going to take me over the edge anyway, so I just decided not to raise up Lumina. And mind only gets raised by walking, and I didn't feel like walking around for another hour. So I was like, I, I'll figure it out. I'll get it before I get to the boss. But yeah, so alright, here we go. Jump over here. Insert statue here. Hells yes, shove it in. He rammed in the statue. And it magically comes apart. Alright, let's go ahead and... Okay, getting close on time here now. Well, doesn't this look epic? Uh, sorry about that. Sneezed. Okay. All right. Gonna have to stop recording soon, but for now, we'll be good. Double jump. Ah, uh, that's not a double jump. That's a no jump. Take that. Jump, 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 jump. Look, my mind went up now. Now everything's max leveled. Okay. Damn it, if I can get across these planes quick enough. Alright, we're gonna stop right here. This has been Spoog on Let's Play Brave Hunter Musashi Part 30. Thanks for watching, and as always, have a good day.